won't go to their food, we bring their food to them. Then we can use it to lure them back home to the Fire Realm. Not a bad idea, Dr. D. What's on the menu? Lava rocks. Ooh, these look perfect. No, girl, these aren't for you. Is Plowhorn all right? She seems a little agitated. Yeah, D. She doesn't normally act like this. Aww. I think she's just worried about getting back to those dragons. I've seen them eat rocks like this before. I'm almost positive this is their feeding ground. They'll be okay, girl. Trust me. I showed my dad what was up last night. I think I know what I'm doing down here. You heard the man. Let's get these rocks back to the crystal realm. Whoa. Ugh. Don't worry, girl. It's gonna be fine. I know what I'm doing. Uh, D'Angelo? Tom? Relax. I got this. D, behind you! <gasps> Back! Ugh. Watch it! <laughs> They're going for it, see? I was right! Okay, but now, how are we gonna lure them out of here? Oh, right. We have to get those rocks back. No, it's too dangerous. We gotta get out of here. D'Angelo, Tom's right. Let's go. What the heck just happened? One minute those dragons were chill, then one sniff of those fire rocks and it's a feeding frenzy. At least we fed them something they didn't regurgitate. Too soon. Any other ideas, D'Angelo? <laughs> Plowhorn seems to know something. Look, I know she's nervous, but I know a lot about animals myself. I study them. I'm gonna be a veterinarian someday. I mean, if my dad trusts me, why can't you guys? We do trust you. Nobody's doubting that you know your stuff, but a good thought can come from anywhere, even a dragon. <laughs> guys, caring for animals is my specialty. Let me get back to those fire dragons so I can fix this. I still got one rock left. We know they'll come after this so we can lure them with it. What do you say, girl? Whoa, hey, girl! Hey! Plowhorn! Listen to me! Plowhorn, this is seriously not cool! Where are you taking me? Plowhorn! She's taking us back to where we found the rocks. I've got a bad feeling about this.